Our lesson for today is about subtraction with regrouping in tens and ones. At the end of the lesson, you should be able to use base 10 blocks to subtract numbers with regrouping in tens and ones. Subtract from three digit numbers with regrouping in tens and ones. Apply the inverse operation of subtraction and addition. Let's recall. What is 14 minus 9? Fourteen minus nine is equal to five. Let us check if the answer is correct by using mental strategy with number bonds. Let us split fourteen into ten and four. Then subtract nine from ten to get one. Add four and one to get 5. What is 34 minus 15? 34 minus 15 is equal to 19. Let us check if the answer is correct by using place value chart and base 10 blocks. 34 has three tens, four ones. 15 has one ten, five ones. Subtract five ones from four ones. Since four ones is less than five ones, we need to regroup the tens and ones. Let us regroup one ten into ten ones to make fourteen ones. Subtract five ones from fourteen ones. Subtract one ten from two tens. Therefore, when we subtract 15 from 34, 19 will be left. Let us check it again by subtracting these numbers in vertical form. Make sure that the numbers are aligned correctly before subtracting. Let us subtract from right to left. Subtract the ones. Since 4 is less than 5, we need to regroup the tens and ones. We will get 1 ten from 3. So 3 will become 2. Then we will regroup 1 ten into 10 ones and add it to 4 to make 14 ones. 14 minus 5 is equal to 9. Subtract the tens. 2 minus 1 is equal to 1. So, 34 minus 15 is equal to 19. We can also check our answer by working backwards. We just need to add the difference to its subtrahend. 9 plus 5 is equal to 14. Carry 1. 1 plus 1 plus 1 is equal to 3. Let's discuss. What is 164 minus 9? Let us find out the answer by using mental strategy with number bonds. Let us split 164 into 154 and 10. Then subtract 9 from 10 
to get one. Then add 154 and one to get 155. Subtract 128 from 242. Let us use place value chart and base 10 blocks. Let us show the base 10 blocks for the greater number, which is 242. 242 has two hundreds. Four tens. Two ones. We will then subtract 128 from this set of base 10 blocks. 128 has 100, 2 tens, 8 ones. Subtract 8 ones from 2 ones. Since 2 is less than 8, we need to regroup the tens and ones. We group 110 into 10 ones to make 12 ones. Subtract 8 ones from 12 ones. Subtract 2 tens from 3 tens. Subtract 100 from 200. Therefore, when we subtract 128 from 242, 114 will be left. Let us subtract these numbers again in vertical form. Make sure that the numbers are aligned correctly before subtracting. Let us subtract from right to left. Subtract the ones. Since two is less than eight, let us regroup the tens and ones. We will get one ten from four. Four will become three. Then we will regroup one ten into ten ones and add it to 2 to make it 12. 12 minus 8 is equal to 4. Subtract the tens. 3 minus 2 is equal to 1. Subtract the hundreds. 2 minus 1 is equal to 1. So, 200 and 42 minus 128 is equal to 114. We can also check our answer by working backwards. We just need to add the difference to its subtrahend. 4 plus 8 is equal to 12. Carry 1. 1 plus 1 plus 2 is equal to 4. 1 plus 1 is equal to 2. It's quiz time! Subtract mentally. What is 465 minus 3? Four hundred and sixty five minus three is equal to subtract mentally. What is five hundred and twenty seven minus ten? Five hundred and twenty seven minus ten is equal to subtract 
contract mentally. What is 965 minus 500? Nine hundred and sixty five minus five hundred is equal to nine hundred Subtract two hundred and seven from seven hundred and sixty three. Seven hundred and sixty three minus two hundred and seven is equal to subtract three hundred and nineteen from five hundred and forty eight. Five hundred and forty eight minus three hundred and nineteen is equal to five hundred and forty-eight minus three hundred and nineteen is equal to five awesome kids you've done a great job for more practice click the link in the description box below that's all for today kids Always remember, it's okay not to know, but it's not okay to not try. Keep on learning!